guys, this is Progarn, and we're going to be playing another round of Advanced Warfare. So, the game actually uh, was launched uh, just a few hours ago to the people that did pre-order it, but never went to the midnight release. Alright, so I'm going to be playing... A little bit of we played free for all thing in the last round, so we'll play some TDM. Hopefully, we get okay. I'm as um I was grinding away a little, not that much of of um when you guys are gone. So I'm level actually 19 instead of level 17, I believe I was before I left off. So got up a few rounds playing with uh, quantum dogs. You guys have seen them in a few videos, in a couple of videos. Yeah, actually, we're seeing them um, in a little bit. Um, actually, in a in a recent video, or gonna be a recent video, on on a video that I'm gonna be doing because he had to go somewhere. So he said he'll be back around 4:30 uh, Eastern time, and we'll record a video from there. So. I'm, I'm so happy that you guys are supporting Events Warfare and like everything. Because know what, it's, from what my perspective of making a game, I don't think it's that uh, easy. Well, actually I know it's not that easy because my dad's a technician and he said it himself that making a video game, not that easy. So, you know, you gotta give these guys a lot, a lot of credit. They're, they're, like, Advanced Warfare, three years. Three years. The guys, they've been working on it. And look how many people have bought it. Over 17 million copies were sold just today. And that's not even people that didn't pre-order it. Obviously, the people that pre-order it want the game a lot. And, um, in other news, Quantum Dog showed me, um, how to get, uh, since I got, um, what do you call it? Uh, oh god, I forgot the name. Day Zero, uh, Access. Uh, I was able to get an exosuit, which is one of the main reasons why I did want it. So, that, um, I have a map that I downloaded. Yeah, and there's a few things I downloaded. I might go over it in a little bit. Probably, in a, probably I might do a review or the whole entire game have gameplay in the background, and then just me, you know, like commentarying over this. I'm actually thinking about doing a live stream soon. So if you guys, I'm still kind of new to the YouTube series. So if you guys can like show me or send me, I don't know, something of how to do a live stream. I would love it so I can do one because I know a lot of big YouTubers, they're now doing live streams and stuff and you know a lot of people, a lot of, a lot of you viewers like it so I might as well, you know what, let's try to do one. So I'm hoping to do one maybe tomorrow after school. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm going to do it tomorrow after school. It'll just be me, you know, playing a whole bunch of games, you know, I won't be, maybe some will be Advanced Warfare. Maybe some will be Ghost, Black Ops 1, who knows, I might have a little bit of Minecraft in it. Who knows, because you guys, today, leave me, leave a comment on how to, how to do a video, how to do a live stream, first of all. And then, and then put a hashtag, and then whatever you want to, whatever gameplay you want to see. Or like Minecraft or anything. Because you know what? You name it, I most likely have it. From the selection that I'm going to be picking through, it will be Black Ops 1. It's going to be Minecraft, Ghost, Events Warfare, MW3. Um, I don't know, and there's a few more games. I'm In the comment, I'm going to, or in the description, I'm going to uh, put what games there will be that... Uh, you guys can choose from. So right now we're 10 and 7. Not the worst, but also not the best. 
the top guy on our list is only leading by two, so just ran away from that gunfight because I know I was not going to win it. He had, see, like that gunfight, I should have never won it. Um, so I'm going to talk a little about it. I have a few series in mind. Uh, Q&A is going to hopefully be one. Um, I'm going to do like reviews on games. This is kind of not a review, but it's also not... Well, no, it, it's kind of a review, but it's mostly gameplay. Um, it's just, I'm just gonna say, like, the good things I like and the not-so-good things. So, we're gonna start off with the not-so-good things. For one, I don't like the thermoscopes. Okay. I tried them out. Uh, today since... Or, uh, yeah, today I tried out the thermoscopes. Not good. Unless you're sniping, and it's like a really dark map like this... You know, I, I might consider it, but unless it's a really dark map, I'm probably not going to ever use a thermal. Um, well, maybe sniping you might use it, but that will probably be just about it, and I'll be using it. Um, uh, this is me. I got the final kill cam. Another bad thing is when uh, you pull the trigger, um, it it's supposed to make you shoot faster. So you hold it down, and a lot of bullets come out. But real, but me playing it a lot, it I think it comes out slower than you pulsating it. So, and now the good things are uh, there. I love just the designs of the maps. I know what I love everything about the game except for those few things. Okay, it's a good game. Um, as I don't know if you guys got to see, but as you see, that's that's the exosuit that you get. Um, pretty sick. I do have this side. Uh, the class I was using was the KF5, and then my attachments were red dot sight, force grip, and rapid fire. Um, I have my combat knife. Uh, you know, I don't have any attachments. Actually, yeah, I think I'll stick with the combat knife. And then for my perks, I have for perk 2, blind eye, and then toughness. And for my exo ability, that's how you got to my exo ability. For my exo ability, I have exo overcloak. It gain. Actually, I'm going to change it to... Exo cloak, you know that'd be really cool. So you're kind of invisible, a little. As you can see, we have we have a few people. We have AFL Assassins 12. Check out their um check out their their clan and their YouTube channel. Uh, he's he's playing um. Events Warfare, we actually have, as I said, we, we have a Quantum Dogs just playing, a lot of people on my friends list was playing Events Warfare, but you know what, Events Warfare is going to be big popular, well, by the next, like, few months, I, I see pretty much almost everyone having it, so, or just about everyone at least. But you know what, you guys definitely pick up a copy. Or if you pre-ordered it, go get it from my GameStop. Because you know what, if you aren't looking for, if you're not getting it, you are going to be missing out on a lot. Because a lot of people are playing it, maybe your friends are, might be playing it, but I definitely give this game a 5 out of 5 star. I know I gave them some downs, but you know what? You know what, I might have gave them a little bit of downs, but those are just minor things. It's not like, oh, I don't like the base layout and stuff, okay, so, definitely. Um, you guys rate, uh, how many stars you would give them out of five. If you guys give them, like, four, three, two, one, five. But I gave them the full five stars, I personally think it's, 
Event, I'm such a big fan of Events Warfare. That's what. That's what I would give them. So. All right, guys. So that was about it. I'm sorry I had to stop. Uh, kind of early. I would have done two video, two. But I want to get more videos up, and you know, the more videos, the better, the more content. I'm actually going to be looking uh, to apply for Optic. Optic. Um, I'm looking to apply for that for clans. So, if you guys have any tips that I can get into, definitely send them or put them in the comments. Alright, guys, see you later.